It's another perfect weekend for the Montana State men who are putting together the team's best season in well over a decade. The Bobcats are 4-0 in conference play for the first time in 13 years. North Dakota's a championship program that's been to the NCAA tournament last year, so they know how to win. They force people into a lot of turnovers, and we only turned the ball over 11 times. Limiting turnovers and winning the rebounding battle are the keys in a 79-68 victory over defending Big Sky champ North Dakota. Our biggest key is to try to win the rebound or the boards, the battle of the boards, because that does have such an impact on how the outcome of games are. Rebounding for us comes down a lot to just toughness and uh, team rebounding and whatnot, so we rely a lot on each other, trusting each other, making sure everyone's got their, you know, their box out responsibility. And of course, it always helps having Tyler Hall hitting shots from anywhere on the floor en route to 25 points. We're about, what, 80 games into this, the Amorani's hit some of that out there before, and I mean, so, you know, I look at the shot attempt more than I look at the distance. Oh, Going through my mind is it's like it's Tyler time. I mean, he's going off in the first half, start cooking, and he gets in that mode. He's a really good player. Two perfect weekends for Montana State so far in the Big Sky, and MSU is 11 and six overall. Just everyone's starting to buy in more and more to what we're doing as a team, and you know what the coaching staff's trying to do and work with us with. But the conference season is long, and I think Coach Fish is trying to say his team is not getting ahead of itself. 18 lap race, got four laps done, 14 to go, and I'm fat, and it's hard to run 18 laps. So I'm gonna go home tonight, eat, maybe sleep, and think about my next profession.